Hey everybody, this is Lisa. Welcome back to my channel. To all my new subscribers, welcome. Okay, you guys, this is week two of the um, Inspiration Collaboration that is with the Facebook group called Crafty Manipulators. So, um, first off, I want to apologize because last week um, was the first week and I did not um, tell you all that C. Alfred is the host for this collaboration. It's a six-week collaboration. And um, once again, she is C. Alfred, and she sees creations here on YouTube. Okay? Um, so, in the description box, I will list all of the collaborators. Okay? So, um, we have C. Alfred, who is the host, Trish Smith, she is the founder of Crafty Manipulators, and then we have Lasagna Burger, Tiffany McGill, Tierra T, Adrian Moore, myself, and um, Brittany Bentley, Barbara Friday, Maria Snook, and Robin Woods Dixon, okay? And like I said, all of those ladies will be in the description box. Make sure you go check out their video today. Um, and this week, we were to make two tags. And my inspiration came from Rosa Kelly, who is Rosa Kelly Scrapbooking here on YouTube. And here is what I made. So these are my tags. So what inspired me is Rosa. She is um, maybe about twice a year. She will do a Prima doll tag swap on her channel. So, um, of course, uh, these are smaller tags. But I have the stamp set that is the LOL collection from Hobby Lobby. So I haven't really used them that much, so I wanted to use them. So since I was doing this size tag, I figured I would stamp um, a couple of in images of the girls and then use those on my tag. So that's what I did. So this one is the first image I used. So I colored her little um, dress up. And then I don't know if you can tell, but I embossed her and then I colored her hair up. And this paper that I used is from the same collection from last week. Is It is a Mambi paper. And I will also have the link to last week's video in the description box as well. So this is the tag that I use. And this is one of those Alina Craft um, tags. I did put a two in the front on the back. Because last week's projects was um, gift packaging. So I figured if anybody would... Well, what it is, is we're going to have a partner at the end of the six weeks that we swap our items to. So I figured if my partner decided to use one of the gift packages, then she may want to put a tag with it. So that way the paper um, collection matches. So I just cut it out a couple of times um, with the pattern paper. And this was actually a piece of the pattern paper. But it was just like in the center where there was no decoration on it. I just wanted that peach color. And on the inside is like the black. Um, a layer of black cardstock. So what I did is I just um, had a scrap piece of the paper that this color came out of. And I just got me a piece and I used my Martha Stewart punch along the edges. And then I cut it out again. Um, with my die so I could get the edge and then I just layered it here 
and then I used some of um, the flowers that I had in my stash and this um, stuff right here is actually a trim it's like a rose flower trim that comes on the row I had got it at Joann's and you purchase it by the yard so I just thought I would put you know a little strip under there just to give it some you know extra and that really filled it in you know it's like a filler so this flower here I've had it in my stash for the longest and it came from Michaels these two are little recollection flowers this one is a um, what I purchased online from overseas and I think this little gold flower here comes from the wedding section at Hobby Lobby along with this little piece and then I got a little butterfly standing up there I've got some little bead um, stamens that I made also here down in here is just a um, big like a little bling piece that is like a peach color so it matches really well then up here I just put some peach tool and peach seam binding that I had in my stash so this is my first tag that I made and then I just put some little flat back pearls so that's my first one and then I pretty much um, did this one similar I just used a different girl so there's the girl and pretty much the same thing I just moved things around same flowers um, same bling piece these are some um, little uh, bead stamens that I made there another little um, butterfly tucked under there so and then I got a butterfly there so yeah pretty much the same I just used a different girl out of the stamp pack now this piece right here was a scrap piece and it was like a you know triangle piece it was just an odd shape scrap piece so I just took the long straight edge and I punched it and then I also just um, um, set my die on it just to give my get my edge the same and it just kinda like goes down this way so you can always use your scraps for layering pieces and then I just put some little flat back pearls there and I just colored her um, skin of her dress I did the dress in like a peach color so that right there is my second tag for this week so you guys uh, once again this is week two for the inspiration collaboration I will link Rosa Kelly's um, channel in the description box along with the um, other collaborators y'all make sure y'all go check them out I thank you all for watching and um, yeah, make sure you come back next week for week three. And y'all have a great rest of your day.